Christmas Day 2021 in Kourou in French Guiana. It's many hours of work, many years of work, and it all comes down to this one precise moment. The Ariane 5 rocket launched the largest and most powerful telescope ever put into space, a moment of anxious anticipation. Then we still have a few minutes before the separation, minutes when we hold our breath. Every stage is very important. The James Webb Space Telescope is 100 times more powerful than its predecessor, the Hubble. Named after a pioneering figure who ran NASA in its early days, it's taken 30 years of research and $10 billion to create. It's like a cocoon that ends up spreading its wings and finally we have a beautiful butterfly. The James Webb was made 10 years after Hubble, so we have new technology. In addition, it's very wide, so it'll be able to gather much more light that comes from much further away in space. Space is extraordinary. Because on Earth, we have telescopes which work very well, but the atmosphere is still turbulent. There's wind, thermal effects. So the images are a bit fuzzy and distorted, instead of being precise. In the 1980s, Pierre Belly worked on telescope design at NASA. When Hubble was put into orbit 600 kilometers from Earth, he was asked to help create the next generation space telescope, even more powerful and effective. Pierre soon found himself with an ambitious aim, to embrace and adapt the most cutting edge developments in capturing invisible light, ensuring they could be used in space. The work was revolutionary, but it all began with rudimentary sketches. Brilliance and innovation gave rise to a creation unlike the telescope's predecessor. This is what happened. There was a conference that took place in 1989 where we realized that no, we don't want to make a larger telescope that works in optics, but we want a telescope that works in infrared. Infrared is invisible to the naked eye, but technological advances mean it's now opening up an entirely new vision of space. There are plenty of reasons why scientists and astronomers want to look at the universe in infrared. There is, for example, the fact that in space, the light that spreads stretches with the universe itself, what is called the expansion of the universe, which means the light that could be visible at one time, by being stretched, becomes invisible to our eyes because it's infrared. The James Webb Telescope will make it possible to see the first lights emitted by the first stars, and therefore to go back in the history of our universe much further than we've managed to do so far. Thousands of scientists and engineers worked on this project, among the challenges to overcome, protecting it from the heat generated by the sun. A five-layer shield the size of a tennis court has been placed under the telescope's mirrors. A cryo-cooler or space refrigerator does the rest. Communication with the Earth is done by all the instruments in the satellite bus Earth side. And stargazing is done on the other side, protected from the sun by the heat shield. This was a truly international project. NASA collaborated with the Canadian and European space agencies. Europe's Ariane 5 rocket, used to launch the telescope into orbit, is described as the world reference for heavy lift launchers, making it an obvious choice for the mission. For the launch of this telescope, there were two main criteria. One was the performance, the possibility to send the mass of the telescope, more than six tons, towards a transfer point where it had to go. And then, a very large volume inside the capsule. There were very few launchers in the world that met those criteria. The James Webb works outside of Earth's orbit, a mind-blowing 1.5 million kilometers away. The telescope has its back to the sun, observing the depths of the universe. It could even help answer the age-old question, is there anybody out there? 
The study of atmospheres of distant planets can potentially give us clues as to the existence of biological activity, perhaps of life on these distant planets. We don't have an instrument with the sensitivity to allow us to see that today. James Webb is going to open a door to the detection of extraterrestrial life. The James Webb will look into a part of space and time never seen before. It's hoped the telescope will provide discoveries to shape our future and illuminate our past.